voters in Inglewood, Hawthorne and other nearby communities will have a complicated section on their ballots for the June 7 statewide primary, a temporary consequence of redistricting and a shock resignation. The runoff in the 62nd Assembly District special election and the primary for the new 61st Assembly District, which will both be on the June 7 ballot, will have a nearly identical slate of candidates and voters. The current 62nd District comprises Inglewood, Hawthorne, Lawndale, El Segundo, Gardena, Westchester, Playa del Rey, Playa Vista, Venice, and Del Rey, and the unincorporated communities of Del Air, West Athens, Lenox, Westmont and Marina Del Rey but the decennial redistricting process took that dis. That alone wouldn't have been a problem. Under normal circumstances, voters would have gone to the polls in June for the primary and in November for the general election to select a representative for the new 61st district. The winning candidate would head to the assembly next year. But earlier this year, Assemblywoman Autumn Burke suddenly resigned, creating a vacancy in the current 62nd district. And so Governor Gavin Newsom called for a special election. The primary for that election took place in April, with Lawndale Mayor Robert Pullen Miles and Democrat Tina Simon McKenna finishing ahead of Nico Ruderman, a former member of the Venice Beach Neighborhood Council, and Hawthorne Councilwoman Angie Reyes English.